stage at Tracy Reese, which is turning out to be one of the most anticipated shows of New York Fashion Week. We got a quick chat with the designer, as well as tips on how to recreate the hair and beauty for the Tracy Reese Spring Collection. In addition to all the energy leading up to Fashion Week, then you just got this other boost. Right. Hello. Huge boost. Tell me about all. Tell me about how that happened and your reaction. Did you know it was coming? We weren't sure. We we sent some things, um, and they told us she may or may not wear something because I'm sure they don't know until the last minute. And if she's anything like I am, you know, it's like how you feel that day when you wake up. You know, it's like that's how I dress. I can hardly ever pick anything the night before. So we didn't know until she stepped out on stage. Um, but she just looked so amazing and she was like glowing. She was lit from within. And everything just came together beautifully. She looked amazing. She made our dress look amazing. The, the dress was really well received. But uh, what would you say are the tips for presidential candidates out there or their wives as they go forward in terms of how they should dress? Do they always have to wear red, white, and blue, for example? No, not at all. I think you should express yourself. And I think that's what's been so refreshing about watching Mrs. Obama. She's her own woman. And this is 2012, you know, and women, we have earned the right to express ourselves and not to be dictated to by, you know, some old rules. And um, she's always appropriate, but she's always herself. And I think that's a, a great example to set for all of us. Tell me about what we all expect to see from Spring from you. Well, it's a very relaxed and fluid collection. There are a lot of great juxtapositions um, in textiles, um, in embellishments, and prints. Um, so we're doing what I'm calling mashups of prints and beading patterns and embroideries. Um, the colors are bright and neutrals, tempered by a little zest of fluorescence, so it all comes together really beautifully, and each color refreshes the other. Um, there's a bit of a tribal influence, which is really cool. You'll see some fringe and, you know, a few other things that um, kind of give it all movement, give it a little bit of soul. Um, it's just a really fun collection that's versatile and easy with an emphasis on great sportswear. Tell me about the look that you created for this uh, Tracy Reese Spring Collection. It's very cool because it's very sort of boyish. Um, skin is very, very natural. We hardly used any foundation at all. Um, the brow is very strong, very statement brow. The eyes sort of look a little bit slept in, like a little bit smudgy. Um, not too much blush, not too much lip. So it's really just about having that very strong, beautiful brow and very glossy eyes and glossy cheekbones. We did these um, fake undercuts where we did deep side parts and then we um, did these very tight braids um, along the lower hairline um, to the opposite side of the head, just behind the ear. So it's kind of a diagonal braid starting from the part. And then you're releasing the top section so it hangs over that braid. So it actually looks like it's been shaved underneath. 